This is the Lunker Hunt Core Strength. It's a crawfish imitating lure. And it's designed to fish over and over and keep catching fish with the internal plastic lining inside of the bait. This can add a little bit of flash as well, but it keeps that plastic from tearing up. Similar to concrete that uses rebar, same concept with this. So the crawfish style bait, you can rig it on a number of uh, different Texas rigs, jigs, uh, all sorts of, you know, use it in trailer situations, but it's gonna have a swimming action in the water with these pincher tails. Try rigging this bait on a Texas rig or a swinging uh, style football head, similar to the Biffle head, with a four to five aught uh, extra wide gap hook. And how I've got this one rigged here, just take the hook, go through the nose of the bait, come out the top, and then Texpose it, which means just putting the plastic right back in on the top there. And then you can drag that on the bottom, you can swim it, uh, it's got a, uh, a nice swimming action to it when you reel it fast, uh, but it just has that big crawfish profile, and you can keep catching fish on this thing without tearing up the plastic. This is a pretty dense plastic, so you want to make sure to use at least a medium heavy action rod when you're fishing this on a Texas rig or a jig head like this. Maybe even bump up to a heavy. And I would also recommend going with a 15 to 20 pound fluorocarbon line and a high speed gear ratio reel. The high speed gear ratio reel will really help when a bass grabs uh, a bait like that and starts coming towards you. You can catch up to them really quick and set the hook. A great situation to throw this core strength in is gonna be any type of rocky type areas that have got some good chunk rocks in it that you can imitate those crawfish that are swimming around. Now I've got dirty water here where I'm at and this black neon core strength is gonna be perfect for what I'm trying to do here. I've got a nice little drop off with some fish that are hanging around in these boulders. So what I'm gonna do is just drag it along the bottom where I see those depth changes and it's a dark enough color in this water that it should attract their attention. And I've got it rigged on that, uh, that Biffle type head. That's just a swinging football jig type head with a uh, extra wide gap hook. The action you wanna imitate on this thing is just a crawfish that's kind of scooting and crawling around on the bottom. When you've got cold weather like we do right now, it's just kind of a slow crawl. And I do like to hop it a few times when I get around a, a nice feeling boulder, just to imitate that crawfish uh, scooting backwards. The pinchers or the, uh, the trailers on this bait are like those pinchers on a crawfish and they really flap around. And the, uh, the foil that's inside also has some flash to it. So if you're fishing dirty water, this could be a really good bait that's got some flash to it, you know, similar to, uh, to a spinner bait type effect. But the main thing is that big crawfish profile that a big bass would like to see.